Hey, what's up coaches? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now in today's video, I feature a coach who has left a great testimonial for our business coaching program. His name is Quentin. Quentin is someone that I've known for the past couple years now. Um, he has gone through our program. Uh, you'll learn about you know the different obstacles he had with his business. Uh, he recently quit his nine to five job um, to go into training full time. He shares his whole story here. So Without further ado, watch this video. Um, and if you're a coach that is wanting to change how you run your business, you wanna do it full time, or you wanna grow beyond where you're at right now, there's a link below this video. You can learn more about our program and shoot me a text if you wanna chat to see if it's a good fit. So that's it, watch this video and uh, you'll be able to meet one of the, the students in our program. Hello. My name is Quentin Torres and I'm a sports performance trainer in Howell, Michigan. And I want to take a second and talk about the benefits I've had from working with Coach Ben and his uh, coaching business and what I've experienced since I sort of entered his program. Now I started, I started my journey back in 2014. Uh, just as a personal trainer and I've slowly kind of worked on I kind of grinded that out for a while and didn't really have like a ton of success as a personal trainer it was always like uh, a lot of a lot of struggling with trying to close sales a lot of struggling with prospecting and trying to draw more business and I eventually started to work my way towards the sports performance side of things that was like my that was like my real passion was like the sports performance training, not so much the fitness training. And uh, eventually I got to a point where I started just taking on sports performance clients, uh, mostly teenagers, mostly high school athletes. And because I had a, a good skill set on training athletes, I did not have a good skill set when it comes to developing a functional business and developing uh, a systematic business that that kind of just helps bring in more revenue uh, helps automate certain systems you know a lot of it I was just sort of just making up on the fly or you know I would just desperately search YouTube to find someone who had the skills or had the knowledge that could teach me you know like this is how you close clients this is how you find new clients. This is how you set up uh, areas for prospecting. This is what you do properly with your social media that directly turns into uh, money instead of just likes and views. So I came across Ben's program on YouTube. He was just doing uh, one of his videos and it was about trying to develop more clients and what to say to athletes uh, after camps or clinics and I thought it was really interesting I was like wow finally like there's actually like someone who's putting this sort of information out there that I could directly use to help me and just from this one YouTube video I immediately saw s small saw small results out of out of his techniques and out of his different methods and so I eventually uh, found his website you know I listen to other testimonials such as the one I'm doing right now and had nothing but great things to say about his program and the success that his coaches uh, were getting seemed very inspirational and very motivating so at the time before working uh, with Ben as I was working a part-time job actually more like a full-time job you know I was driving around uh, different car dealerships and hanging American flags in a giant truck with a cherry picker and I was doing that for $20 an hour and I would do that during the day you know I would try to bang out as many hours as I could with the flag job and then after I was done doing that I would have to drive from Le I'd make like a 40 minute drive all the way back to Brighton to, to train to train my my athletes and to train my clients and it was always week by week. It was always trying to trying to work as fast as possible to get to, to get the jobs done during the day and then come in 
and try to like eat something while I'm in the car and, and hopefully have enough energy to give to my clients to try to make them better. And I never knew when my next client was going to, my next client sign up was going to be. Uh, I never knew how long I would have these clients for. I was basically like hitting the gas pedal and the brake uh, at the same time in my business. And I was just burning cylinders on both ends. And I was getting worn out. I was getting tired. I was getting demotivated. Uh, I thought about quitting a couple times. And I was just... I just didn't have good systems and good practices set in place, which made the job that I was doing like 10 times harder and it made my stress so much more than it had to be. And I think so to kind of break down some numbers is I was working around 60 hours a week doing the flag job and doing training. And I was probably bringing in with my flag job, I was bringing in maybe like thirty thousand dollars a year that was kind of keeping me supported and then after i was done with the flags i'd have to train clients from 5 p.m to about 9 p.m not consistently like i have a six o'clock then i'd have a break then i'd have like an eight o'clock then a nine o'clock and then you know because I would take clients at any time schedule, you know, and I'd fit their schedule. I would say I'd make myself available for them. I was training people from 9 to 10, 10 p.m. at night. And then I'd get home, eat, go to bed, wake up at 6 to get to the flag job, you know. And, I, and I'd train weekends. I'd tra I, I would work with people Saturdays and Sundays, you know. And I just thought this is... This is the way, like, you have to do it, you know, if you want to make your dreams happen. And I was only making about, honestly, for, for, for five years doing that, I was only making, I never got higher than, like, $15,000 a year in training, you know. But I was just, I, I loved the job so much, and I loved helping people, and I loved, you know, implementing my training system and seeing results and making the impact in people's lives that I didn't want to give it up. And I didn't really know how to, like, make the business more efficient, how to develop it better, you know. So, so I signed up with Ben. And, and honestly, after just one phone call with Ben, completely changed my training program. Completely changed how I went about uh, talking to coaches, how I went about talking to future clients, how I went about... Uh, developing my systems and my payment practices like all of that changed just honestly just after like just the first phone call and after that like I just knew like this is this is a guy I need to learn from this is like he's a great mentor and this is this is the direction I need to head and make some serious changes within myself if I want this business to be successful and if I want to continue making an impact with more athletes more kids uh, you know, uh, more clients and even for myself so I can develop the life that I've always wanted where I don't necessarily have to like, you know, look on ESPN and see some of these other coaches living the dream. Like I can, I can now live that dream and I can make that, make that into a reality. Uh, so, so the types of results that I've seen, like since I've started with Ben's program is that I've been able to quit my part-time job of uh, doing the flags and uh, I went from a fifteen to thirteen thousand dollar a year training business uh, to just after my first uh, year to about thirty five thousand dollars a year just in training. No part, no, no second full time job to help complement that. I was able to just do, just do clients and training all year long, which to me was just amazing. Like, it was just the first time since 2014 where I can just be a full-time trainer, where I just have people working with me, doing what I love day in and day out, with no having to run from job to job, eat my lunch in the car, you know, and always, like, struggle to wonder where the next client's going to be. Um, changes that I've seen with my business... Uh, um, having things very streamlined, having things very automated, having uh, different practices, 
and, uh, and implementing very strict policies in my business. You know, like uh, getting rid of bad habits that were really killing my energy and killing my mental health. You know, we're not tolerating uh, clients that were, were making me bend to their schedule, uh, not, not tolerating late payments, uh, having, just like I said, having things more automated and it's really freed up more hours in my day so I can now like live my life, you know, where I can have like a relationship. I can, you know, I can go home and I can eat and I could not have to like worry about, okay, like if I eat like in a half hour and I take a shower, I can get to bed by this time where I can get eight hours of sleep and then wake up. You know, I don't have to like waste my brain energy thinking about those things that were just killing my, my mental health. And, and it's, it's just really been life changing. It's also changed the way I, I feel about myself as a person, you know, my confidence, my ability as a trainer, uh, and the lack of anxiety that I no longer have to live with. Like there's still, I mean, you still got to make a business run. You still got to put in the work and you still got to make a lot of changes that are going to be very challenging for you as a person. But this is uh, a step-by-step -step process that works. Uh, it it uh, it really fixes a lot of uh, systems that honestly, we just as trainers, you just don't know like how to do certain things. Like no one has actually sat down and taught us, and that's one thing that I kind of want to address. Like above all else, is the resource that Ben provides coaches you know especially in the united states i feel like so many trainers and coaches they learn a lot about their sport or they learn a lot about their uh their their skill set as far as creating exercises and making athletes better but no one teaches us how to run the business properly no one teaches us how to make sure that the money is coming in, how to make sure that we're receiving more clients and, and doing the proper work, not just working on things, but doing the right kind of work uh, with the right kind of systems. And I'll tell you what, I've looked for a program like this uh, for years, for years and years and years. I would search YouTube, like high and low, uh, uh, Google, everything to just try to find someone who has like the information or the knowledge should be like, hey, this is how you do this. This is how you, this is what you say when you talk to coaches. This is what you do when you call parents. This is what you do to close a sale. These are, this is what you do as far as finding a building or rent, like very step-by-step -step things that honestly, so many, I know I met so many trainers and coaches that just quit. Like the average lifespan of a personal trainer is six months. Like I've probably seen 40 people come and go from this coaching or personal training industry or sports performance industry and it all came down to like they were great at their abilities to train and to coach but they just didn't know how to make the business run successfully honestly it's a huge it's, it's a huge deficit i see in the coaching industry it's just not having these basic ideas down and someone who can kind of hold you accountable and help you develop these skills to run a successful business. And these skills are translatable between uh, whether you're doing soccer, whether you're doing basketball, whether you're doing sports performance, whether you're doing, I mean, bowling. Like these, these skills, not only that, they've these skills have helped improve like even just everyday things within my life, even like my domestic responsibilities or, or, or how it's helped me live a better, more, mentally sound life so I can, you know, develop relationships with people, you know, so I have way less anxiety. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to make this testimony to kind of talk about some of the areas that I feel like this has really helped me with. And I think that if you're in the industry of personal training, sports performance, or coaching uh, for sports, it's absolutely imperative that you find a program or you get involved with this program because the results, the results are just truly life changing. And I'm really excited and I'm really looking forward to my business developing and where I'm going to be in the next, in the next five to 10 years. 
uh, staying with this program. So my name is Quentin Torres, sports performance trainer out of Howell, Michigan. And yeah, hopefully we see you on the other side.